So one thing I love doing in the salon with Olaplex number two is to add it to direct dyes, a hair color that doesn't need any processing. So to show you guys an example, I had my guest Grace in the salon yesterday and she was looking to tone down her old highlights. These highlights are highlights that we had put in so I didn't need to change the placement of the highlights. I just wanted to overlay them with a nice direct dye hair color. So the color I chose to tone down Grace's highlights was a nice chestnut brown. You could do the same process with any type of direct dye, including fantasy colors. So to do this process is pretty simple and quick. The first thing I did was I added two ounces of Olaplex number no. two to a bowl, and then I put the direct dye directly into it and got that to the desired level I was looking for. Once that's all mixed up, then I took her back to the shampoo bowl, I wet her hair down, and I applied our formula from scalp to ends and let that sit on for at least 10 minutes. In this case, we let it sit on for about 15 minutes. Then I shampooed it out because you always shampoo out Olaplex number Number two. Then I conditioned using the direct dye in the conditioner as well. After we got her cut and styled, we gave her a really nice makeover. Then what I did was I talked to her about her home maintenance. And what that's gonna be is using Olaplex number three first, leave that on her hair for 10 minutes once a week, and then she can use her shampoo, and then the customized conditioner with the direct dye in it as her daily maintenance. The benefit to doing this is that you're gonna be building the bonds in your guest's hair while you do the treatment. So it's gonna save you time, and it's gonna bump up your average ticket in the salon. For more tips, go to Olaplex.com or download the Olaplex app on your mobile device. Thanks.